So hi, I'm Pierre Chow and I'm a feature designer. So today I'm going to talk about Twelve Zodiacs of 2021. And I'm sure everyone's very excited to know more about what's about to come and what they should expect. So let's start with number one. So the rat in 2020, you had experienced what we call the Fanheiser year. So generally that's, that means a bit more instability and you might have experienced quite a tough year, but it can be opposite. So sometimes you can have a very good year, even when you're in the fun high year. But the good news is in 2021, that is all gone. And you're coming into what we call the star of union. So you can, obviously it is a very positive um, energy and it really generally representing um, the union of relationships, the partners, friends. So expect a lot of good news in that area. And um, so with also work-wise, you will also experience a lot of changes, but mostly very positive. And you can also, uh, if you're looking to be, you know, promoted or even have salary raise, um, there is a likely chance that that will happen in 2021. And so the last thing for the rat is, it, it's also good to try something new. So if you're trying to start a business or you've been also thinking about starting something, um, you know, like a maybe a store or whatever that it is, it, it's a good year to do so. But obviously, you know, because you just came out from 2020, uh, give yourself a bit more time to recover. So that's a good key thing to remember. So the ox, which is the year, the same year of uh, the ox year 2021. So which means you're fantastic. And that can be quite worrying and um, quite concerning for most people. But don't worry. So the key there's a traditional way of fixing this or minimizing the bad energy is to have more positive energy in your life. So the recommendation is to, let's say, if you get married or if you can have um, babies, then you should do that in this year. But obviously not everyone can do that. Um, so the other option is to just accumulate as much positive energy into your life as much as possible. So even if you have friends getting married, if you have friends um, having baby showers, just go and like take all that into your life, all that positive energy into your life. And so this will really help with 2021. And obviously the other stuff is to be more aware of your health and work-wise, relationship, family. So there's a lot more instability in these areas, but also if you just keep a mindful um, and um, to train your mind to be more not just not only positive but to be more balanced so this is a, a very good practice for everyone so tiger is also coming into a very good year it's called um um Hub tiger, which representing a little bit of union energy in there not as strong as the one with the rat or um the one with the, yeah the rat and so people who are generally born in summertime uh, from April, May, and June will experience actually quite a good energy in the finance area. And those ones who are born in the autumn and winter uh, be more mindful of the relationship part and work part. Um, there is a lot to do with the communication with your colleagues or your friends. So just be more mindful what you say and how you say it. And so this will really help with the coming year. So the rabbit, which is, I'm also a rabbit. So um, there is a star, which is called the travel star, which represents um, movement, shift, and travel, obviously. But obviously, you know, when you do have the star, you should technically have more, be more active, travel more, but it's not very easy right now at this moment. So I do recommend those ones that are the rabbit to travel locally 
explore more places and to be more active and go outdoor, you know, just go into nature and get some fresh air. And so the other thing is in the career sector, there's going to be a bit more hard work and busy. You're going to be having a very busy year. So take care of yourself. Um, your health will um, be affected if you don't be more mindful of how stressful you are. So stress management is the key to positive energy in 2021 for the rabbit. So the dragon um, is called the Pang Chong Tiger. So that represents um, more movement in the relationship part, but more with friendships and a little bit to do with family, which means for you to be more aware of there are changes happening in relationships or with friendships that you are already um, having at the moment. Um, be a bit more cautious. There is going to be a bit more conflict, misunderstanding, um, and just be more mindful of how you communicate with the, your loved ones around you. And just a bit more aware of the emotional side of your, for yourself too, and the ones around you, because obviously, even this year has been, I believe, very tough for everyone. So um, emotional management is the key to good health for the dragons. So the snake is Soundwave Tyson, which is very good news. And so for those who are the snake, you will have a lot of good opportunities, new opportunities in work and friendship and relationships. So um, it's good to be more, um, I would say, you know, holding a positive uh, mindset and perspective and be more explorative, uh, try new things, and um, learn some new things. And this will really help you to gain more uh, good friends in the coming year. And you will find very good help in the work area. The horse is Yang Chun Tai Shui, which is a, a, one of the Fan Tai Shui. Um, uh, so it, it represents um, some movement and mostly in the health area and friendship. So be more aware of your health, obviously, and to be careful of um, just very, if you're a clumsy person, just be a little bit more careful with, you know, uh, even when you're walking or exercising, to be careful of small injuries. And um, there's also a lot more, uh, a bit, I guess a bit more drama in the relationship part. And it's good to actually Focus on yourself more instead of other people. So this is a key point for the horse uh, zodiac. So sheep is coming into a Chongtai Sui year, which representing a lot of changes, a lot of shift, and um, mainly uh, it's kind of scary for most people because change is scary generally, but actually it is opening up more room for you to grow and an opportunity for you to take on challenges. So it's, it's good to have that mindset before you go into this year. And uh, expect more movement. Uh, for example, you, for the sheep, you tend to have to move home or offices a bit more uh, chance in 2020. So monkey, uh, there is nothing that stands out. So there's no fantasy story for you guys, um, but there is a very positive energy in partnership and friendship. So if you're looking to do business or starting a business with a partner, uh, you will find people that very uh, much click right away. Um, and then you will find good help in work-wise. So if you're looking to hire people for your company, um, you will likely find very good help this year. In the relationship part, um, it's good to be more active and be more social and to remember that sharing uh, opinions is a good thing and to learn different opinions will open up your, your mind. So the rooster is also a sandwich. 
which is a very good thing, very good energy in the union energy. So this means for work and relationship, you will experience a lot of good um, opportunities. So meeting people that really can help you or can really help you take your business to a different level, to a higher level. And for those who are single um, or not married, you will very likely have good news in that area. So um, yeah, so that's for the rooster. Dog is standing, Kaiser. So this is one of the five Kaiser zodiac. So be more aware of your health, which is also mental and physical health. Um, especially managing your emotions and your mental health is actually key to good health. And for the dog to, you know, open up more, talk to friends, and find somebody that can actually speak to you um, about your worries or concerns, and to be remember that, um, you know, life is all about. That we all have ups, ups and downs and, and it's okay. And to remember that um, as long as you are willing to adapt, then 2021 will be just fine for you. So Pig is also experiencing a gate mousing. So it is a start of traveling, which means you will have a very busy year usually for hard work, um, you've got to run around and be on your feet all the time. Um, and the other thing is to travel more often and don't stay in one spot. So if you can change your environment, your office, your home um, in 2021, that's a very good thing to do. And it will draw new energy into your life and that will really help you to expand or continue what you do in 2021. Okay, so that's it. So thank you everyone for watching. And so I just want to say happy Chinese New Year, go have a joy, and a prosperous and healthy 2021 for everyone. So remember to you know tune in, share this um, with your friends, and to follow SEMP on IG, which is SEMP underscore style. And also you can follow me as well. Mine is Thierry Chow, which is T-H-I-E-R-Y-C-H-O-W. And to, if you want to know more Go Lucky, which is my brand and my IG, you can just go check out my IG and you will find all the updates on there.